Hello friends, welcome back to the new video of React Native. So today we are going to learn about the how we are going to convert the HTML to PDF in React Native. So let's get started. So we are going to install this module React Native HTML to PDF. So let's see what exactly this module does. Okay. And see the how many downloads we have so it, this is automatic linkage is there and we have to link manual also so let's see that so let's open the project okay project has been opened now we are going to add the react native HTML to PDF okay now it's saved Moving to the next up, uh, linking. So I, I guess linking is not there. I guess let me check again. No, there. So manual linking. So go to this one. Okay, then Android settings dot Gradle. Android settings dot Gradle. So I need to add it over here. it but next we have dependencies don't require main application dot Java copy this main application dot Java I think it's already opened here where main application dot Java it is the add this line over here and then we have uh, include the package these two packages okay so I'm going to add this min application dot Java. Just add this two packages. Okay. Done. But next we have external uh, storage. So let's go to the Android dot manifest. Here we go with the Android manifest. Right and what we have read and write both we need so where it is okay so this is we have added but next then we have to use it like create pdf options and then we have to convert that options and use this pdf okay so moving to the next part let's go to, uh, let me first of all Elastic search it consumes the memory almost. Let's open Android Studio for syncing the project. So build it. creating the build meantime we will go with app.js and uh, add our code which I uh, these things are not done yet multi text so we need to go with the uh, Android Gradle build Gradle So where we have a dependency default config and dependencies default config default config give me a second where is default config in app where is default config 
this is the default config so we need to add it over here So I'm going with this and I'm going to add over here where it is build.gradle so this is added dependencies we will add this one so this part is done Okay, let's again sync it so there is the problem over here build dot gradle line number 19 cannot find the method implementation okay so we will not going to add this I think we have added implementation over here control X it's not here basically in the dependencies uh, in settings build dot gradle here so where we have dependencies so here we need to add this okay and let's move to this build so it's running So where it is the error main react package so I think it not may not needs to be there so let's compile the code so build is ready so let's make the build but here we are going with this they have added new main react package but here we are uh, import Orion let's see the build now it's installing be successful now we are going to add the reset cache reload so it's reloading add our any disk
so we have opened the AnyDesk let me connect the AnyDesk I haven't updated this app.js so let me update this app.js so I need to add this line of code to convert this app.js let's come in. sorry here we have left with import So here we are going to it I need to reopen again is something entering is not there so let me open the code again I need to open in any of the another one let me So it's open. Let's add the code. Okay, is anything missing? Word wrap. Okay, there is an issue here. Now it's sorted. So now we are going to create the PDF first when I click on the create PDF it will give me allow to assess the photos media contents and the files I will say allow okay it will add it in the files docs test.pdf let me check over here so let me go to my file manager Maybe in the documents we have, let me check. It's in the Android data. So you can see that over here. Mm, here you can see that com exios files docs test.pdf so you can see that if I go to view this one the PDF which we have down created from the text you can see that the PDF is there okay the same thing that we have done already in the this part so you can see that whatever we have added the text over here it is file name test directory is docs okay and that is converting the full path okay so this is how we can convert the pdf and uh, save into the local storage and show and we can show that also from that part okay so any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section because this part is already there in this code you can see that they have a def default create PDF with the options and this option with the help to convert your options into the PDF you need to just perform this action on press create PDF this function and this create PDF will do the rest of the thing okay so this is how we have done it so any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day. Don't forget to like, share and comment on my video. Have a great day.